morning y'all turn the music down i can see i am on my way to go to the store because i need to grab just one quick little thing because i need to do my hair this morning i went out and i took pictures in public it was so awkward taking pictures in public places just makes me so nervous but I have I had this idea in my head so I was just like you know what I'm gonna do this I want to go and take pictures out in public but it makes you nervous and you have a tripod and everything it may help to go really early in the morning but here it's sunny right now but it's hurricane season so after about two o'clock the sun goes away and i don't see it anymore for the rest of the day because of the past the way that these past few weeks have been for me i've just been trying to do things to keep me busy so i'm just using this time to experiment once i come back from the store i'll show you guys the outfit that i'm wearing it's pretty much the most fall outfit that I can possibly do with as hot as it is. This is the outfit that I wore. I intentionally purchased clothing items that can be mixed and matched with other pieces to have these cut off shorts. They stock right about here, but I just rolled them up. They're from Meshki. I have this top from Zara, and then I have this sweater that I just put over my shoulders, but I also have been like taking it and tying it like this kind of adjusting it in different ways. I feel like it just adds something to this outfit and it keeps me warm when I've been going inside of stores. And like without it, it's just, it's cute. But with it on, it's like different. For my pictures, I wore these boots that I got from Aldo's. I'm not sure if they're still in stock because I bought them last year, but if they are, I will link them down in the description box. And I wore these tan socks from Nike. I don't know if you guys know about this, but a lot of companies have just taken white Nike socks and dyed them to be like all of these different shades of tans and browns and milk and like these really pretty neutral earth tone colors so i have some of these socks i was going to order them from one of those companies but they sell out so fast they're pretty pricey so josh saw those in the nike store the other week and he just grabbed some for me but this was my outfit this is my outfit good morning happy wednesday I'm making breakfast this morning. I lost all of my footage yesterday. I went to go edit three videos, lost the footage for all of them. The file went corrupt. I was so... <sighs> On the bright side, I went to the gym this morning because of it. So it took that atrocity all that hard work going down the drain for me to go to the gym because i haven't gone to the gym since april i struggle with consistency but all this stress is putting me back in to what i need to do which is take care of myself all the vlog what was going to be a vlog it's gone this is the new vlog hey girls that happens sometimes it is what it is. I think it was just a sign, you know, because this month has just been a lot. My aunt passed away at the beginning of this month, and that has been... I talked about that a little bit on the vlog footage that is no longer here. So I guess it was never meant to come out <laughs> because I, I got pretty emotional. My aunt was so many positive things. She was extremely understanding. She was so patient. She was so forgiving. And I'm just trying to embody those things as I navigate through life. I'm going to eat and take a shower and just get my mental together. This the brekkie brekkie. Real simple. Just some fried egg bacon and cinnamon rolls because I've been craving something sweet. <laughs>
believe and see it. Mm -hmm. I don't know what they're even gonna be talking about, but let's see. Good morning, you guys. It's Thursday and I'm just sitting here trying to get organized. Today, we're, uh, 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 we're gonna try to get some things done. Y'all like my shirt? My family and I wore that shirt when we went up to Virginia for Juneteenth this year. It was so much fun. We went to Washington, D.C. I really should start vlogging my trips. Would you guys be interested in that? I'm new to this whole vlogging thing, but I be, I be doing stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Last night, I ordered some stuff from Urban Skin RX because I like to use their skincare products for my face, but your girl has body acne. I have it along my shoulders. I got the, I don't even know if you guys can see it. Can you even see it? Got the AHH Dark Spot Polish. I also got the Clear and Even Tone Body Cleansing Bar. I want to try the products out on my shoulders and then just document how that is for me. It's not as bad as it used to be, but that, I used to get all of these pimples right here. These are, all of my acne scarring and everything is from before I found out that I have a hormonal disorder and I didn't know why the heck I was breaking out when this is something that had never even happened to me before. This isn't sponsored or anything. I do have a coupon code with them if you're interested. If you use this code, you'll get 15% off on all purchases made on their website. Also leave that down in the description box below for you guys because those coupon codes really be helping when it comes to beauty products because they can get to be pricey. If you guys are watching this video and any subsequent videos after that, that means that I received my external drive. My SD card is no longer going corrupt and we are good to go. Cause this, all of this, yeah, yeah, we're good. Hey guys, it's Friday afternoon and I am sitting here editing a video i ended up getting this external drive to hold my footage which i'm so glad that i have this now because i didn't have an external drive before so i was uploading all of my footage and memory onto my laptop having to delete everything when i ran out of storage which was actually quite often I had hair videos, skincare routines. I had so much that I had to refilm. And of course, like the vlog footage, I can't go back and refilm that. So we'll just hope for it better in the future. I mean, a lesson, which I wanna close this video out with that lesson. What I learned this week is that it is so easy to be negative. For whatever reason, it is so hard. It seems like everything is just starting to fall apart around you and in your life. It's so easy to become negative and fall into that trap. So I was fighting against falling into the trap of negativity all week. And it's a constant battle, but it's a battle that I win. It doesn't feel good when I start thinking negative because a few bad things happened and it really just starts to make everything else in my life do, 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 tumble down and it, it's just not worth it. So with everything that happened this week, me losing my footage, with me still going through the grief of losing a loved one, even though I'm a planner, I'm not in control of what happens. I cannot control what happens to me, but I do have to be conscious of how I react to the situations that happen around me because it can either make my life better or worse. We made it. It's Friday. We made it. I'm going to end this vlog here, y'all. I will catch you guys in the next one.